Well, the entire week has been our school bus safety week. So this is almost like a grand finale where we invite the drivers in and celebrate them, not only just the drivers, the entire transportation department, to thank them for their service, uh, for transporting our students to and from school every day. We have accomplished about 16 million miles with no accident, no injury to students. Really, every week is but safe two weeks. Uh, you know, we, we do practice and procedures, but yet yeah, it's a reason why we do it. My biggest thing is, is courtesy, you know, because I always extend it to the drivers, you know, not uh, for it to be reciprocated, but just as a courtesy. Uh, but understand that, you know, whether you know that kid or not, uh, you're connected to the community. So it could be the neighbor's kid, it could be your brother's kids. It could be somebody's kids, but that should be the first thing in your mind is to extend courtesy to the buses. I'm at the bus at 6 a.m. So I pre-trip my bus, make sure it's safe, look under the engine, check the tires, check the fluids, etc. Make sure the inside of the bus is safe too. And then I uh, leave the lot. But um, as, as I pick up the children, I make sure that they're in, we call the safe, I call it my compartment. Uh, because if they're sitting in the seats right, if they're facing forward like they should be, it acts like a seatbelt for them. So that's one thing I want to say is if you're sitting correctly, those, those seats are to protect you. Civil cars that are running are stop signs. Um, that is a big problem uh, in our area. I was just on the bus two days in a row and actually had two cars almost past us. I mean, they're right at the point. Um, so that is a big awareness, whether it be in the rural part of the county or also here in the urban ring. Um, we have a lot of issues with that, so if we can get it out to the public, you know, we are in school, session is in between 6 and 9 in the mornings, and then again between that 4, 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock, up to 5, um, that, that is our big times, and we do have a lot of issues with that. So we especially ask that parents, their motorists, to be careful, be watchful, um, when they see the school bus stopping, take the precaution to make sure that they stop, because so often, we have people to run the driver's red lights, and that's unsafe for our students. This is a hard job. Make no mistake about it. It's a hard job, very rewarding job. Why? We're transporting our students. So when you think about the fact that they have to drive the bus, keep their eye on the road, watch out for others and the students on board, that is worth celebrating because this is, this is incredible work, and it leads to the success of our students.